your Dharakarika planet holds profound significance in Vedic astrology, symbolizing your spouse or long-term partner. It serves as a pivotal factor in predicting not only the timing of your marriage, but also offering insights into your enduring relationships. The Dharakarika reveals itself through the planet occupying the lowest degree among the seven Jaimini Charakaraka in your birth chart, excluding Rahu and Ketu. This planet embodies the qualities and characteristics of your future life partner. By scrutinizing the placement of your Dharakarika, a treasure trove of information about your prospective spouse unfolds. The position and dignity of the Dharakarika can provide insights into the nature, qualities, and characteristics of one's spouse or partner. Its placement in specific houses of the birth chart can indicate the potential experiences and dynamics within the marital relationship. As with other aspects of astrology, interpretation of the Dharakarika should be done in addition with other factors in the birth chart for a comprehensive understanding. It's essential to underscore that while the Dharakarika planet offers valuable insights into relationships, it's just one of several factors to consider when examining a birth chart for matters related to marriage. Alongside the Dharakarika, factors such as the seventh house, its lord, planet's position within it, and the dignity of the seventh house lord collectively shape the individual's relational dynamics. Each of these elements works in tandem and should not be viewed separately. Rather, they form a bigger picture for understanding relationship potentials. Prioritizing either the Dharakarika or the Seventh House Lord over the other would be misleading, as both contribute significantly to the overall impact on relationships. The Dharakarika's effects complement those of the Seventh House Lord, offering additional layers of insight into partnership dynamics. When the Dharakarika, the Seventh House Lord, and other factors coincide within a birth chart, it accentuates the significance of their combined influence. For example, in the case of a Libra Ascendant individual where Mars serves as the Seventh House Lord, if Mars is also the Dharakarika planet, the characteristics associated with Mars become particularly pronounced in the context of relationships. The interplay between these elements provides a more nuanced understanding of relationship potentials within the birth chart. It's crucial to analyze the entire chart comprehensively to grasp the complete picture accurately. When examining the Dharakarika's influence in different houses, it's essential to consider how the qualities associated with each planet manifest within the context of partnerships. For instance, if Venus is the Dharakarika and occupies the seventh house, it may indicate a strong emphasis on love, harmony, and sensual pleasures within the marriage or partnership. If Saturn is the Dharakarika and resides in the seventh house, it suggests a more pragmatic, disciplined approach to relationships, characterized by stability, commitment, and responsibility. When considering the significance of various planets as Dharakarikas, it's essential to acknowledge the duality they bring to a horoscope. Each planet represents a blend of positive and negative influences, shaping the individual's experiences and relationships. However, if a planet serves as a Dharakarika and is malefic for the specific horoscope, it can introduce challenges and obstacles into the individual's life. The dignity of the Dharakarika planet in the horoscope plays a pivotal role in determining the nature of relationships and partnerships. Factors such as combustion, debilitation, affliction, and malefic status influence the outcomes associated with the Dharakarika. For instance, if the Dharakarika planet is afflicted or debilitated, it may indicate difficulties or conflicts in relationships. Similarly, if it is a malefic for the horoscope, it could signify potential harm or endings within partnerships. Overall, understanding the role of the Dharakarika and its placement within the birth chart provides valuable insights into relationship potentials. However, it's crucial to interpret these insights within the broader context of the entire chart, considering the interactions between the Dharakarika the seventh house, and other relevant factors. By doing so, one can gain a more comprehensive understanding of relationship dynamics and potentials within the individual's life. With this context in mind, let's delve into the predictions for different planets as Dharakarikas. The placement of the sun as the Dharakarika in a birth chart offers profound insights into the dynamics of long-term partnerships and marital relationships. Your significant other or lifelong companion might exhibit Leo placements in their birth chart, showcasing a dominant sun presence. This could manifest as the sun occupying prominent positions such as the first house, serving as the Atmakarika, being exalted, or having sun-ruled nakshatras placements. These configurations often imbue them with qualities associated with the sun's energy, leadership, vitality, charisma, and a radiant personality. They may possess a natural magnetism, 
a zest for life, and a penchant for taking the lead in various aspects of their life and relationship. Their radiant personality and natural magnetism could make them the center of attention in your relationship. They may possess a commanding presence and a gift for inspiring others, fueling your partnership with energy and enthusiasm. Their innate leadership qualities might manifest in their ability to take charge and make things happen, guiding you both towards success and fulfillment. Their warmth and generosity could create a nurturing environment for your relationship to thrive. They may radiate warmth and optimism, infusing your life together with joy and vitality. Their unwavering self-assurance and courage might inspire you to embrace your own strengths and pursue your passions with conviction. The influence of the sun as the Dharakarika extends beyond mere personality traits. It also suggests a strong connection between the spouse and their father, indicating that the father figure may play a significant role in shaping the partner's character and values. The themes of the house where the sun is positioned in the birth chart will resonate strongly in the partner's life, influencing their experiences, aspirations, and priorities. However, the presence of the sun as the Dharakari Ka can introduce certain complexities into the dynamics of the relationship. The sun's inherent desire for authority and control may manifest as a tendency for the partner to assert their opinions and decisions, potentially leading to conflicts or power struggles within the partnership. This desire for dominance can be exacerbated if the sun is afflicted in the birth chart, resulting in ego clashes or communication breakdowns. If the sun is heavily afflicted, such as being debilitated or influenced by malefic planets like Rahu or Ketu, it may give rise to more significant challenges. This could include heightened aggression, emotional distance, or even a stubborn mentality within the relationship. Narcissistic tendencies may emerge, making it difficult to resolve conflicts or reconcile differences. Despite these potential pitfalls, individuals with the sun as the Dharakarika often exhibit a strong drive for success and achievement, particularly in their professional endeavors. This ambition can lead to positive outcomes in their career, with the partner likely to attain recognition and success in their chosen field. However, this intense focus on career advancement may also strain the relationship, leading to feelings of neglect or imbalance between partners. Navigating a partnership where the sun is the Dharakareka requires careful attention to communication, mutual respect, and understanding. While the relationship may experience moments of brightness and happiness, it is essential to address underlying issues and work towards resolution during challenging times. Couples should strive to cultivate a healthy balance between individual aspirations and shared goals, fostering mutual support and growth in the process. Individuals with the sun as the Dharakarika should be mindful of potential pitfalls, such as excessive ego or control tendencies. Cultivating humility, empathy, and a willingness to compromise can help mitigate conflicts and strengthen the bond between partners. By fostering open communication and a deep sense of partnership, couples can navigate the complexities of their relationship with grace and resilience. Overall, the placement of the sun as the Dharakarika offers valuable insights into the dynamics of long-term partnerships and marriages. By understanding and embracing the strengths and challenges associated with this placement, individuals can cultivate healthier, more fulfilling relationships with their spouses or long-term partners, fostering mutual growth, happiness, and lasting love. When the moon assumes the role of Dharakarika in a birth chart, it exerts significant influence on the dynamics and qualities defining long-term partnerships and marital relationships. The moon symbolizes traits such as nurturing, kindness, emotional sensitivity, and a profound inclination towards caring for others. Individuals with the moon as Dharakarika are likely to attract a spouse or long-term partner who radiates these qualities, seeking to establish a nurturing and supportive environment within their relationships. Your spouse or long-term partner may have cancer placements in their birth chart, indicating a dominant influence of the moon. This could manifest in various ways, such as having the moon prominently positioned in the first house, serving as their Athmakarika, being exalted, or having moon-ruled nakshatra placements. These configurations often endow them with qualities associated with the moon's energy, emotional depth, nurturing tendencies, intuition, and sensitivity. Their emotional intelligence and empathetic nature serve as pillars of support and understanding in your relationship. They possess a profound connection to their inner world and are deeply attuned to the ebbs and flows of emotions, both theirs and yours. Their caring and protective instincts make them a comforting presence in times of need, fostering a sense of security and belonging in your shared life. They naturally gravitate towards providing comfort, sympathy, and emotional support to their partner, often embodying a maternal instinct in their interactions. A notable aspect of having the moon as the Dharakareka is the influence of the partner's mother in their life. 
This implies that the partner shares a close bond with their mother or is deeply influenced by her values and behavior. The partner may be drawn towards activities that involve nurturing or caring for others, aligning with the moon's inherent tendency towards compassion and empathy. However, alongside these nurturing qualities, the moon as Dharakarika can also present challenges within the dynamics of the relationship. Individuals with this placement may struggle with emotional insecurity and clinginess, especially if the moon is weakly positioned in the birth chart. This can manifest as a constant need for reassurance and attention from their partner, potentially leading to feelings of suffocation or dependency within the relationship. The partner's nurturing tendencies may sometimes border on being overbearing, with unsolicited advice or excessive pampering becoming sources of tension. There may be instances where the partner feels unappreciated or undervalued, leading to emotional outbursts or periods of withdrawal as they grapple with feelings of neglect. If the moon is afflicted in the birth chart, either through debilitation, combustion, or malefic influences, these challenges may intensify. This can result in heightened emotional volatility, mood swings, or even bouts of depression within the relationship. In such cases, external intervention or counseling may be necessary to address underlying issues and restore harmony. Despite these potential pitfalls, individuals with the moon as the Dharakare Ka possess the capacity for deep empathy, understanding, and unconditional love within their relationships. Building and maintaining trust become paramount in navigating the complexities of a partnership where the moon plays a central role. Open communication, mutual respect, and efforts to reciprocate love and care can help fortify the bond between partners and mitigate the impact of any challenges that may arise. Ultimately, the moon as Dharakare Ka offers an opportunity for profound emotional connection and intimacy within relationships. By embracing the nurturing qualities of the moon and working together to overcome obstacles, couples can cultivate a supportive and loving partnership that withstands the test of time. However, it is crucial to approach the relationship with awareness and sensitivity, acknowledging the unique dynamics that the moon as Dharakare Ka brings and endeavoring to create a nurturing and harmonious union. Overall, the moon as Dharakare Ka serves as a guiding force in shaping the emotional landscape of long-term partnerships and marriages. By understanding and embracing the nuances of this placement, individuals can navigate the intricacies of their relationship with compassion, empathy, and resilience, fostering a deep and enduring connection with their partner. Mars holds a pivotal role in shaping the dynamics of relationships when it serves as the Dharakarika. Understanding the nuances of this placement offers profound insights into the nature of partnerships and the potential outcomes they entail. With Mars symbolizing traits ranging from protectiveness and courage to dominance and aggression, its influence on the partner and the relationship as a whole is multifaceted and deeply impactful. Your spouse or long-term partner might exhibit Mars dominance in their birth chart, indicating a strong influence of the red planet. This dominance could manifest in several ways, such as having Aries or Scorpio placements, Mars prominently positioned in the first house, serving as their Athmakare Ka, or being exalted, or having planetary placements in Mars ruled nakshatras. These configurations often endow them with qualities associated with Mars, passion, courage, assertiveness, and drive. Their dynamic energy and assertive nature could manifest as a proactive approach to life and relationships. They may be natural leaders, unafraid to pursue their goals with determination and vigor. Their adventurous spirit and willingness to take risks might infuse your relationship with excitement and a sense of adventure encouraging both of you to embrace new experiences and challenges together. At its core, Mars signifies strength, ambition, and assertiveness. When Mars is strong in the chart, individuals tend to exhibit qualities such as courage, determination, and a strong sense of self. These traits extend to their approach to relationships, where they may appear protective, passionate, and unwavering in their commitment. A partner influenced by a strong Mars is likely to be ambitious, straightforward, and driven, with a propensity for physical activity and perhaps an interest in spiritual or occult areas. When Mars is weakened or afflicted, its influence can manifest in more negative ways. Traits such as dominance, control, or even violence may emerge in the partner, leading to challenges within the relationship. In such cases, it becomes essential to navigate the dynamics with care and address underlying issues to ensure a healthy and fulfilling partnership. When Mars serves as the Dharakare Ka, Indicating its significance in matters of marriage and long-term partnerships, compatibility becomes paramount. The success of the relationship hinges on the confidence and security of both individuals. If both partners are comfortable in their own skin and deeply committed to each other, the relationship has the potential to flourish. This mutual confidence fosters a sense of trust and perseverance, 
allowing the couple to weather the storms of life together. In relationships where Mars is prominent, there is often a shared sense of purpose and drive. They are motivated and willful, with a strong focus on both their careers and their marriage. They actively prioritize spending time together, making efforts to nurture their bond amidst the demands of daily life. This dedication and mutual respect serve as the foundation for a lasting and fulfilling partnership. However, sustaining a healthy relationship requires more than just shared goals and ambitions. Love, affection, and empathy are essential ingredients that deepen the emotional connection between partners. Without these qualities, the relationship may become strained, with partners drifting apart as they prioritize other aspects of their lives over their bond. Communication is another key aspect of maintaining a strong relationship influenced by Mars. Open and honest communication allows partners to address issues as they arise, preventing resentment from festering and driving a wedge between them. Trust, respect, and understanding form the bedrock of a successful partnership, enabling couples to navigate the inevitable ups and downs of life together. In cases where Mars is heavily afflicted, challenges within the relationship may escalate. Moodiness, volatility, and passive aggression can erode the foundation of trust and intimacy, leading to conflict and potential breakdowns. In such situations, it becomes crucial for both partners to seek support and guidance, whether through counseling or other means, to address underlying issues and rebuild their connection. Overall, the placement of Mars as the Dharakarika offers valuable insights into the dynamics of relationships and the potential challenges they may face. By understanding and embracing the influence of Mars, couples can cultivate a partnership built on mutual respect, trust, and shared values, laying the groundwork for a fulfilling and enduring bond. The influence of Mercury as the Dharakarika in relationships brings forth a dynamic interplay of characteristics that profoundly shape the nature of partnerships. Mercury, known for its communicative prowess and intellectual acumen, serves as the cornerstone of connection in relationships. Partners influenced by a strong Mercury are likely to exhibit traits such as wit, humor, intelligence, and communicative skills. This creates a foundation where communication flows effortlessly, fostering understanding and companionship. Your significant other or lifelong companion may exhibit Mercury dominance in their birth chart, suggesting a profound influence of the planet of communication and intellect. This dominance could manifest in various ways, such as having Gemini or Virgo placements, Mercury prominently positioned in the first house, serving as their Athmakarika, being exalted, or having planetary placements in Mercury-ruled nakshatras. These configurations often endow them with qualities associated with Mercury, intelligence, versatility, wit, and curiosity. Their sharp intellect and analytical mindset could manifest in a keen interest in learning and exploring new ideas. They may possess a natural gift for communication, adept at expressing themselves with clarity and eloquence. Their ability to adapt to different situations and their quick wit might make them captivating conversationalists, stimulating your mind and enriching your conversations together. Their practicality and attention to detail could complement your relationship, helping you both navigate life's complexities with efficiency and precision. The relationship may begin as a friendship, facilitated by mutual interests or social circles, and evolve into a deeper bond rooted in shared intellect and curiosity. However, the strength of Mercury in the chart significantly influences the nature of the spouse or partner and the dynamics of the relationship. When Mercury is strong, individuals may attract partners who embody the youthful exuberance and intelligence associated with Mercury. These partners are often witty, friendly, and multi-talented with a youthful charm that belies their age. The relationship may be characterized by lively conversations, shared interests, and a vibrant social life. If Mercury is weakened or afflicted, its influence may manifest in less desirable ways. Partners may exhibit traits such as childishness, illogical thinking, or excessive criticism, which can strain the relationship. The partner's approach may oscillate between being fun-loving and overly analytical, leading to conflicts and misunderstandings. It becomes essential to navigate these challenges with patience and understanding, prioritizing effective communication and mutual respect. One notable aspect of Mercury as the Dharakarika is its association with youthfulness and vitality. Partners influenced by Mercury may possess a youthful appearance or demeanor, adding a playful and energetic dimension to the relationship. However, this youthful energy can also manifest as immaturity or a lack of seriousness posing challenges in navigating the responsibilities and complexities of a long-term partnership. The relationship dynamic may be further influenced by the partner's perfectionist tendencies and a penchant for criticism. Partners may find themselves subjected to constant scrutiny and correction, 
leading to feelings of inadequacy or frustration. It becomes crucial for them to strike a balance between maintaining individuality and accommodating each other's needs and preferences. Despite the potential challenges, a relationship influenced by Mercury as the Dharakarika can offer unique opportunities for growth and fulfillment. Partners may be drawn to careers or pursuits that involve communication, intellect, or technology. The relationship may thrive in environments where they can engage their analytical minds and practical approach to problem solving. However, the involvement of malefic influences can exacerbate the challenges posed by Mercury's influence, leading to heightened criticism, conflict, and dissatisfaction. It becomes imperative for them to address underlying issues and cultivate mutual respect and understanding to sustain the relationship. Overall, Mercury as the Dharakarika brings both blessings and challenges to relationships, shaping the dynamics in profound ways. Effective communication, mutual respect, and a willingness to navigate challenges together are essential for fostering a healthy and fulfilling partnership under Mercury's influence. While the journey may be fraught with obstacles, the potential for growth and connection makes it a worthwhile endeavor for those willing to invest the time and effort. The placement of Jupiter as the Dharakarika in one's birth chart offers profound insights into the nature and dynamics of their long-term relationships, particularly with their spouse or life partner. Jupiter, often associated with wisdom, guidance, and prosperity, serves as a significant influence on the qualities and experiences encountered within the partnership. Your spouse or long-term partner may display Jupiter dominance in their birth chart, indicating a significant influence of the planet of expansion, wisdom, and abundance. This dominance could manifest in various ways, such as having Sagittarius or Pisces placements, Jupiter prominently positioned in the first house, serving as their Athmakarika, being exalted, or having planetary placements in Jupiter-ruled nakshatras. These configurations often endow them with qualities associated with Jupiter, optimism, generosity, wisdom, and a broad-minded perspective. Their expansive outlook on life and their innate sense of faith and optimism could serve as a guiding light in your relationship. They may possess a natural inclination toward growth and exploration, always seeking to broaden their horizons and expand their understanding of the world. Their generosity and benevolence might make them a source of inspiration and support, encouraging you to embrace new opportunities and pursue your dreams with confidence. Their wisdom and philosophical nature could enrich your relationship, fostering deep conversations and meaningful exchanges of ideas. They may have a natural affinity for spirituality and higher knowledge, guiding you both on a journey of self-discovery and personal growth. When Jupiter is in a favorable position, it suggests the arrival of a spouse who embodies virtues akin to those of a saint. This suggests a partner who is not only knowledgeable and kind but also possesses a wealth of wisdom and support. Their moral integrity and devotion to their beliefs can serve as pillars of strength within the relationship, fostering a sense of spiritual or philosophical depth that enriches the bond between them. Their jovial nature and ability to bring laughter and joy into the partnership create an atmosphere of warmth and camaraderie, making them not only a life partner but also a trusted confidant and advisor. When Jupiter is afflicted or in a weakened position, it may indicate potential challenges within the relationship. This could manifest as conflicts arising from differences in moral values or philosophical outlooks, or it could suggest a partner who struggles to embody the virtues typically associated with Jupiter. In such instances, navigating the complexities of the relationship requires a considerable degree of understanding, empathy, and patience from both parties. One notable aspect of partnerships influenced by Jupiter as the Dharakarika is the expectation of largeness of heart from both individuals. While the spouse may naturally exhibit qualities of generosity, forgiveness, and magnanimity, it is equally important for the other partner to reciprocate these gestures. This involves being emotionally supportive, financially generous, and respectful of each other's social circles and familial ties. Maintaining a harmonious balance where both parties contribute to the relationship's growth and stability is essential for its long-term success. Jupiter as the Dharakarika has the potential to attract prosperity and abundance over time. As the bond between the partners strengthens, so too does their growth and prosperity. This may manifest in various forms, including career advancements, financial gains, and opportunities for personal development and fulfillment. In addition to benefiting the partners themselves, the influence of Jupiter as the Dharakarika extends to their children as well. A stable and nurturing relationship provides an optimal environment for the upbringing of wise, intelligent, and ambitious offspring. These children are likely to excel academically and professionally, equipped with the resilience and determination needed to navigate life's challenges and pursue their aspirations with confidence. On a professional level, 
Their partner may exhibit a strong emphasis on education and continuous learning. They are likely to pursue higher qualifications and certifications, using them as catalysts for career advancement and personal growth. This dedication to self-improvement not only benefits the individuals themselves but also contributes to the overall success and stability of the relationship. Overall, having Jupiter as the Dharakarika in a relationship signifies immense potential for growth, prosperity, and wisdom. However, realizing this potential requires both partners to approach the union with maturity, generosity, and a willingness to contribute to each other's well-being and fulfillment. By fostering a dynamic characterized by mutual respect, shared values, and unwavering support, couples can create a partnership that not only withstands the test of time but also thrives in the face of adversity. When Venus takes the pivotal role of Dharakarika in one's birth chart, it signals a profound influence on the nature and dynamics of relationships. This planetary alignment brings forth a partner who embodies Venusian qualities and amalgamation of beauty, charm, sensuality, and material abundance. The presence of Venus as Dharakarika indicates that the partner is likely to possess either physical attractiveness, significant wealth, or perhaps both. This individual exudes an aura of allure, drawing others in with their captivating presence and magnetic charm. They tend to have a keen appreciation for the finer things in life, demonstrating a penchant for luxury, artistry, and indulgence. Your spouse or long-term partner might exhibit Venus dominance in their birth chart, indicating a significant influence of the planet of love, beauty, and harmony. This dominance could manifest in various ways, such as having Taurus or Libra placements, Venus prominently positioned in the first house, serving as their Athmakarika, being exalted, or having prominent planetary placements in Venus-ruled nakshatras. These configurations often endow them with qualities associated with Venus, charm, grace, sensuality, and a deep appreciation for aesthetics. Their magnetic charisma and captivating presence could make them a beacon of beauty and allure in your relationship. They may possess an innate ability to create harmony and foster connection, infusing your partnership with warmth and affection. Their romantic nature and love of luxury might inspire you both to indulge in life's pleasures and cultivate a sense of romance and intimacy. Their artistic sensibilities and appreciation for the finer things in life could enrich your shared experiences, whether through exploring art, music, or culinary delights together. They may have a talent for creating beauty in their surroundings and a knack for making you feel cherished and valued. The partner characterized by Venus as Dharakarika is often described as sensual, artistic, and socially adept. They possess a natural charm and diplomatic demeanor, making them adept at navigating social interactions and building meaningful connections. Their affable nature and pleasant disposition make them highly likable, attracting a multitude of admirers and well-wishers. This partner may also have a strong affinity for creative pursuits, such as music, painting, or culinary arts further enhancing their allure and enriching the relationship with shared interests. In practical terms, having Venus as the Dharakarika can manifest in a lifestyle marked by indulgence and enjoyment of life's pleasures. Couples with this astrological alignment may find themselves frequently dining out at upscale restaurants, attending cultural events, or indulging in luxurious experiences. Their love for aesthetic beauty and sensual delights creates a harmonious bond, enriching their relationship with shared experiences and mutual enjoyment. However, while the indulgent lifestyle may bring joy and fulfillment, it also poses potential challenges, particularly in terms of financial management and responsible spending. The allure of Venus as Dharakarika extends beyond mere physical or material attributes. It encompasses the creation of a harmonious and aesthetically pleasing home environment. They may often take great pride in curating their living spaces, adorning them with beautiful furnishings, artwork, and decorative elements. The home becomes a sanctuary of love and beauty, reflecting the couple's shared values and appreciation for artistry. The partner with Venus prominence may exhibit a talent or passion for a specific artistic pursuit, further enriching the domestic atmosphere with their creativity and expression. Despite the myriad blessings associated with Venus as Dharakarika, challenges may arise, particularly in sustaining long-term commitments. The tendency for multiple breakups or short-lived relationships is a potential pitfall especially if Venus is afflicted in the chart. Afflictions such as conjunctions with malefic planets like Rahu can disrupt the harmony in partnerships, leading to periods of dissatisfaction and emotional turmoil. In extreme cases, individuals with afflicted Venus may seek solace outside the relationship, attempting to fill the void created by unmet emotional needs or desires. Navigating a relationship where Venus serves as the Dharakarika demands mindfulness, communication, and emotional intelligence. 
couples must cultivate mutual respect, trust, and understanding, recognizing that the pursuit of material pleasures alone cannot sustain a fulfilling partnership. By embracing the positive attributes of Venus while remaining vigilant against its potential pitfalls, individuals can nurture enduring and meaningful relationships that stand the test of time. Ultimately, the journey of love and companionship guided by Venus as Dharakarika is one of profound beauty, enrichment, and spiritual growth. The influence of Saturn as the Dharakarika in relationships offers valuable insights into the dynamics and potential outcomes of partnerships. Saturn, with its disciplined and practical nature, shapes the long-term partner or spouse to embody characteristics that reflect its influence. Regardless of the zodiac sign Saturn occupies, individuals whose Dharakarika is Saturn can anticipate a partner who is grounded, serious, and committed. Your spouse or long-term partner may have Saturn dominance in their birth chart, indicating a significant influence of the planet of discipline, responsibility, and structure. This dominance could manifest in various ways, such as having Capricorn or Aquarius placements, Saturn prominently positioned in the first house, serving as their Athmakarika, being exalted, or having strong Saturn-ruled Nakshatra's placements. These configurations often endow them with qualities associated with Saturn, maturity, resilience, determination, and a strong sense of duty. Their steadfastness and commitment to their goals could serve as a pillar of stability in your relationship. They may possess a strong work ethic and a disciplined approach to life, inspiring you both to strive for excellence and persevere through challenges. Their sense of responsibility and practicality might provide a solid foundation for your partnership, ensuring that you navigate life's ups and downs with resilience and fortitude. Their wisdom and patience could foster a deep sense of trust and respect between you. They may have a knack for offering sage advice and guidance, helping you both make sound decisions and stay focused on your long-term objectives. One of the defining traits of a Saturn-influenced partner is their practicality. They approach the relationship with a pragmatic mindset, focusing on the practical aspects of life rather than solely on emotions or romance. This practical approach extends to their behavior within the relationship, as they prioritize stability, responsibility, and long-term planning. They are likely to be hardworking and diligent, willing to put in the effort necessary to build a solid foundation for the partnership. Saturn's influence suggests that the partner may be older or more mature, bringing a sense of wisdom and experience to the relationship. This maturity can manifest in various ways, such as being more responsible, reliable, and disciplined in their actions. While they may not always express their emotions openly or be particularly romantic, their commitment to the relationship is unwavering once they have made a commitment. In addition to practicality and maturity, individuals with Saturn as their Dharakarika may find their partners to be reserved or introverted at times. They may prefer solitude or quiet reflection and may not be as outgoing or social as other partners. However, despite their reserved nature, they are deeply committed to the relationship and are willing to work through challenges and difficulties together. Respect is a fundamental aspect of relationships where Saturn is prominent. Spouse or long-term partners of individuals with Saturn as their Dharakarika place great importance on being treated with respect and dignity by their partners. They value equality and fairness in the relationship and expect their partner to acknowledge their worth and contributions. Lack of respect or appreciation can lead to dissatisfaction and resentment within the relationship, as they may feel undervalued or taken for granted. They may hold on to past grievances and bring them up during arguments or disagreements. They have a strong sense of accountability and expect their partner to take responsibility for their actions. Forgiveness may be harder to come by if they feel that their value or respect has been compromised. However, they are also willing to work through challenges and conflicts if they believe that the relationship is worth fighting for. Challenges within the relationship may intensify during Saturn's dashas or unfavorable transits, leading to periods of strain and difficulty. Patience, resilience, and a willingness to work through challenges are essential for maintaining stability and harmony in such relationships. Despite potential challenges, relationships where Saturn is the Dharakarika have the potential to be enduring and deeply fulfilling, characterized by practicality, commitment, and mutual respect. Overall, Saturn's influence as the Dharakarika in relationships offers valuable insights into the dynamics and potential outcomes of partnerships. Individuals with Saturn as their Dharakarika can expect a partner who is practical, mature, and committed, with a strong emphasis on stability, responsibility, and respect. While challenges may arise, particularly during Saturn's dashas or unfavorable transits, these relationships have the potential to be enduring and deeply fulfilling for those who are willing to work through difficulties and cultivate mutual understanding and respect.
The Dharakarika planet holds an important role in Vedic astrology, where it serves as the significator of the spouse or partner in a person's life. Determined by the planet with the lowest degree in the birth chart, the Dharakarika offers insights into the qualities and characteristics of one's future spouse or long-term partner. While it provides valuable information, it's essential to consider it alongside other factors such as the seventh house lord, planets in the seventh house, and their dignity. These elements work together to paint a comprehensive picture of relationship potentials within the birth chart. By analyzing the interactions between the Dharakarika, the seventh house, and other relevant factors, astrologers can offer deeper insights into the dynamics of marriage and partnerships. Ultimately, understanding the Dharakarika and its placement within the birth chart contributes to a more nuanced interpretation of relationship dynamics and potentials in an individual's life. If you'd like more personalized predictions or have any questions about your birth chart, feel free to reach out to us. Stay tuned for more contents. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more astrological insights. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so you never miss an update. Thank you once again for joining us, and we eagerly anticipate sharing more astrological wisdom with you in the future. Until then, keep exploring, keep learning, and keep shining bright.